Welcome to NotJustAnime.com. I am Jody Joe. Thank you guys so very much for being here. I'm alone on this reaction, and that could be a good thing. Listen, NotJustAnime.com is the place, the website that's been created by us for you guys to consume anime content in the best way possible. The servers, the layout, it's all top-notch quality. You join through Patreon. You come and sign up to NotJustAnime.com and you get exact access to the Not Just Anime mother freaking Discord. That's right. Get access to the Discord. Get all the uncut reactions. And I'm Jody Joe and we go on to episode 9, episode 10 of Demon Slayer. Yeah. This love Hashira for to put in some work. And there she go. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Tear him up, baby. Cut right through all of that tree. That dragon tree. That wood Hashira, bro. Huh. Wood style. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you. This has gone too far. I'm taking Nezuko and Genya back from you. Silent, shameless tramp. There's only uh. one person who can order me around, and it isn't you. <laughs> shameless tramp? Me? Oh, You're talking one. about me? You've got to be kidding! What a foul mouth that boy has! And to think he's around the same age as my younger brother! Oh, wait, maybe he's not, because demons don't always look their actual age, do they? Still, what a horrible thing to say! Crazed my eyes feel dry. Thunder death! Ms. God dang! Love breathing! Love breathing. Oh my! <laughs> this young girl somehow managed to slash through my attack. She tight, bro. Oh my I've goodness. Never seen a sword like that. And you know how many much skill this takes? It takes a lot of skill to jump around with the following it. it. Yeah, being able to wield that? It's a whip. That could go any different direction. She can keep up with this speed. Then I'll bury her with a spell. Blood demon art. Countless striking trees. Swaying love. Wild claws. Damn! What the freak? She chopping everything. Inconceivable. Wait, I see. This girl's slender physique belies her true muscle density. An abnormal constitution. This is good. Consuming high quality flesh leads directly to gaining strength. I'll pulverize her skull and brain tissue to a pulp. Freaking flashbacks! Oh. Ms. Kanroji, no person would ever marry you. But if you're lucky, a bear, boar, or cow might. What? Your unnatural hair color is bizarre. The idea of passing it to my children makes me shudder. I cannot arrange a marriage with you. Whoa. Please forget that you ever met me. <laughs> <laughs> Are you really showing off in front of our child? My arms were so thin that I wasn't able to flex them. <laughs> Even though I was still just a child, I wanted to help her in the kitchen. Are you really sure about this? It's totally fine. There's no need for you to hold back at all. Well, you heard the man, right? So no excuses. So she's stronger than everybody. She's abnormally strong, and like genetically. Go. Your arms may be thin, Mitsuri, but the density of your muscles is downright extraordinary. <gasps> but, Dad, aren't women supposed to get married and become someone's mother? Sure, but you could also just stay at home. Yeah, that too. You don't have to be a mom. The day my perspective you don't have to get married. Off, I decided I had to hide it all. You don't have to be a thought pocket either. 
so I dyed my hair black. I stifled my urge to eat, and I pretended to be weak. Oh. Everyone in my family worried about me. I ain't gonna lie though, bro. She looked kind of sexy with that black hair, bro. He wanted to marry me. Should I do this? No, this isn't right. It can't be. For sure, we back. Your struggling is comical. God damn. She did? I never lose to a jerk like you. Let's go. Let's see. Damn, man. All that time I'm seeing the freaking Miss Tasha do his thing and I was thinking about how strong he is. But bro, like she's doing feats that make that what that Miss Tasha did seem futile. I ain't gonna lie. She's so emotional and in tune with her emotions. I like that. She's such a woman. You gotta let she's sexy. She got tig old bitty. She got them thighs. She got that voice. She bad, bro. She a 10 out of 10. And she got that inside, that heart, that mind. All that she connected. Dang, girl, go ahead. From the bottom of our hearts, thank you. Thank you, miss. That's nice. It was Mr. Egerel who gave me the long She She on a Ren Goku sheet. I ain't gonna lie to you. Oh, that's that trash snake nigga. Well, not trash, but he's weird and shit. He's another Hashira. Oh, he likes her. He likes her. I promise you I'll treasure them. There's no need to treasure them. Orochimaru and shit. You guys go on ahead. Defeat the main body. Nezuko, Genya. Go faster. Hit stronger. More. There it is. Cut it, cut it, cut it. If you want to get to my comrades, then you're going to have to get through me. You have to slash that little shit, that little, little neck, that little neck is strong. Tanjiro hit it and it wouldn't break through. What the heck? This young girl, she's moving even faster than before. I don't understand. What's happening? How is she? A mark? Did she always have that? That looks like a demon's crest. This is beyond annoying. Thanks to the slip of a girl, I can't unleash my dragons on those brats. She's like freak out of all of it. That sword is epic, bro. It won't last forever. Neither will you. Stamina eventually. The way all humans do. I will protect them. No matter the cost. Get out of there, you bastard! Is she fighting back? How the freak? If I devour demons, it's only temporary. But I can gain demonic traits. It boosts my regenerative abilities and increases my muscular strength. Oh, that's what he been doing. He didn't turn to a demon. He, oh, he ate that shit. Okay, that makes sense now. I was tripping. I thought this whole time, man, this motherfucker was turning and shit. Now they explain it. He ate that food to get his power and then took some of the traits. That's why he looks like that. Okay. Um, that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. I roll with it. I have with it. This won't end until I behead the main body. Tanjiro, do it! Where is he? You win. Perfect. It's gone. Shot to Hitman. It must have run off again. Oh my god, you didn't see it? it Come on, dog. Far. That little motherfucker is annoying. You're not escaping me! <laughs> talk, talk, talk. Make that shit walk. No one else can take responsibility for what you've done. 
Ever since the day I was born into this accursed world, I've never once uttered a lie. I'm a virtuous weakling. As <laughs> pitiful as I am, nobody shows me any sympathy. I... <laughs> I... <laughs> I never told a lie. <laughs> Y'all sitting there watching this nigga run. Y'all been sitting there this whole time watching him get away. episodes in this shit bro hey look guys we're gonna talk we're gonna we're gonna end up talking about the season like how we feel about it as a whole but individually as episodes that's how we gonna keep it this episode was cool and all but like i just i just feel like they're doing a lot fast yet while at the same time not progressing the story much at all like think about this shit Ep season one huge progression like the whole world got introduced Season two, elevated it to the next level. Muzan, the history, family line, all that, Rengoku, all of that epic. And then look where we are with season three. This is like, you're just in a village for like one night. Like you're in here in one night. Zenitsu and, and, and um, Inosuke are probably asleep doing a training with something. All this shit happened in like one night. Like this shit is like not going anywhere. You spent a whole season off of... The Mist Hashira and a little bit of the Love Hashira and two of these demons. Like, we haven't seen Muzan. This shit leaving me starving. Like, this this season's not good. Like, if you look at the season what it's supposed to be compared to two and one, this is the worst season, bro. Like, let's keep it a thousand. It's still epic. It still has great fights and all that. But I care about the story a lot, bro. The story means a lot to me. We're going through, we're going back in history. Like, we're looking at Hashira's backstory. When I really rather see Inosuke and Zenitsu's growth in their future. Like, when we finally get to them, those characters are going to be like in the same place they were uh, over a year ago. I don't like that. I really don't like that. And this is just, I just, this reminds me of how much like we're wasting time here. Like, we could, we didn't have to be doing, especially with the Mist Hashira, we didn't have to do all of that. That was just too much backstory. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he got four episodes. And I could understand if the season was like 20 episodes, then okay. There's only one, one more episode left. So what the freak? I don't know, that's crazy. Uh, cliffhanger episode, more of the same. I think that I'm gonna have to get this a C plus, bro. I may have to get this a C plus. This is probably my second least favorite of this whole series, bro, season. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Join notjustanime.com for the uncut reaction as well as access to the Discord. You see people be signing up while we freaking reacting and shit. So that's what's up, man. Thank you guys. I'm Joe Joe, and I'm out. Deuces.